To create a ClickBank account, then just simply go to clickbank.com and you'll see a page similar to this. And in the top corner there, you can see create account. So we'll click on that. And then you'll see here, you can sign up for a free ClickBank account. So you've got personal information. These are the three stages that you'll need to go through. Personal information, banking information, and account information. So first of all, you can see here your preferred language. So in this case, it's English. Just click on that to, to see the drop down to change that. Country, just click on the drop down and choose which country you're in. First name, last name, street address, your apartment suite or other, postal code, city, phone number, and email address. Okay, so just fill out those details and then click on next step button at the bottom. So I'll do that now and I'll come back in a second. So the next stage is to fill out your banking information. So you can see here it asks for pay name, uh, the name of the bank, and the country that your bank is in. So once you've filled out those, then remember to check this box here. I've read uh, and agreed to the terms and conditions. You can click that link if you need to read those and then click on next step. So I'll do that now. And just something quick to point out, you will actually, before you check this box here, you will actually need to click on this link uh, to read the terms and conditions. Um, it's just to cover their back really. They obviously want you to, to go through these terms and conditions first. Um, that'll open up in a new tab and then once you've gone through that, then you can come back and check this box and then just click on next step. So once you click on next step, you should see this um, capture code appear. So this is just to verify that you're not a robot. And you can see here, select all squares with vehicles uh, vehicles in or part of the vehicle in. So we're looking at this one, these, potentially that one as well. So next, and again, any square with a vehicle in. So we've got that one, that, uh, and there and verify okay so now you can see it's gone to account information so account credentials your account nickname will be the username or the id that you use to access your account and will be displayed in the memo of all payments you receive from clickbank your nickname will also be visible to every customer during the order process please note that once you, sub you submit your form your account nickname cannot be changed okay so you need to put in a nickname and a password. Now, where it says that your nickname will be visible to every customer, what happens is when you send a visitor to a sales page, so if you're promoting a product and you send them to a sales page, then once they are happy with that, if they go through and actually click on the buy now button, they go through to an order form. And once they see the order form, then when you scroll all the way down to the bottom, this is a good point as well, just to make sure that your affiliate link's working and that you're going to be uh, receiving commissions. If you scroll on the order form, if you scroll all the way down to the bottom, then you'll see right down at the bottom here, you'll see your nickname or your, you know, whichever nickname you've created, you'll see that at the bottom. So in this case, obviously, I'm using, um, you know, my, my account's Mark Laxton with, a, with two Ts, um, but... It wouldn't be very. Um, it wouldn't look very good if someone scrolled down to the bottom of an order form, and they saw someone's first and last name. So in that case, just try and think of something that um, probably it sounds fairly generic, um, or you know, if uh, chances are it's going to be taken. But something like secure order form that would be perfect, really. If someone scrolled down to an order form and they saw secure order form then uh, they wouldn't obviously think this is um, someone's you know affiliate link or anything like that or some someone's promoted it as an affiliate so just have a little think about your nickname um, and you know it could be a number of different letters characters um, you know numbers anything like that um, so put in your nickname and your password and then check here I would like to uh, link my new account to an existing Clickbank account Okay, so if you do already have a ClickBank account, then obviously you can link that up and then simply click on create account. So I'll do that now and I'll come back shortly. So once you've filled out your details, then you'll be taken to this page. So you can see this is the, client, uh, the ClickBank client survey. So you just need to check a few uh, boxes here. So how are you planning to use this specific ClickBank account? So I'm going to check it's a, an affiliate account. Uh, obviously you can choose a vendor if you're a product creator, both vendor and affiliate or other, so for joint ventures. So I'm, in this case, we're just gonna leave that as affiliate. If you have, uh, if you already have other ClickBank accounts, please list them here. So if you do have any, just put them in there. 
So you just put in like your nickname for there. So what is your level of experience with online marketing? So I'm just starting one to two years, two to five, five to 10 or 10 or more. So I'm just gonna put 10 or more for this case. Uh, what is your biggest obstacle in finding success? So you don't have to, um, <coughs> excuse me, you don't know how to drive your own traffic. Uh, you get lost in the technical aspects of building my online business. Uh, I don't know what niche to get into. I'm weighed down by information overload. I don't even know where to start. Okay, so in this in this case, I'm just going to tick this. This is very common for, for a lot of people when they get involved in um, internet marketing. They get weighed down with information overload. Take on too many, buy too many courses and, and just start going through just about everything that they can possibly get their hands on, which obviously doesn't help. So how do you personally use uh, technology in your business? I only surf the web and will be outsourcing nearly all aspects of my business. I'm comfortable using hosted tools and publish my content on Blogger, etc. I'm comfortable owning my own domain and using packaged tools with uh, to publish content to WordPress, etc. Uh, I'm an experienced computer programmer and comfortably customize my site. Okay, so I'm going to put this one for now. So, what do you feel your benefit? Uh, what do you feel you would benefit from most? So, coaches um, to teach you how to get started and how to stay on track software to help you create and automate the technical aspects of your business a community of like-minded people that can net, that you can network with okay so i think co coaches is obviously very um popular with people now uh, it's very helpful to have coaches and have that one-on-one -on -one, um you know actually talking to people one-on-one -on -one, getting you know sort of specific help for whatever you need so as a vendor or an affiliate Please uh, select all the ways in which you currently drive traffic. So paid search, organic search, take that, content marketing, mobile apps, paid media apps, and uh, display advertising, banner ads, email marketing, that's one of the biggest um, ways to drive traffic really, obviously building your list. Social media marketing, another massive way of, of, of uh, driving lots of free traffic. Word of mouth, not generally, not if you're online. Uh, links from other sites and other so I might check that as well so as a vendor or an affiliate please select the language in which you plan to sell or promote so mostly it's going to be English uh, as a vendor or an affiliate what is the approximate size of the audience you uh, reach on a monthly basis so if you've got um, if you've got any kind of email list or following on social media um, that kind of thing then uh, obviously you can choose that here so I'm going to go for that Excuse me. And uh, what do you hope to expect to earn monthly from this ClickBank account? So anything would be great. A hundred dollars a month, uh, between a hundred to a thousand a month, between a thousand to ten thousand a month, more than ten thousand. So we'll go for that one. And as an affiliate or a vendor, in which niche do you plan to sell or promote products? So select uh, all to apply. So obviously you can check that to select them all, or you can uncheck it and in this case if we're sort of more towards internet marketing then we might think of things like software and services um let's have a look education yeah e-business and e-marketing definitely computers and internet business and investing um and we'll just leave it like that for now so once you've gone through this obviously um you know go through this yourself and if you know if you're not in in these niches then you, you know if you're looking at um, parenting or self-help or anything like that go through these just fill all these details out and then once you're done click on the submit survey after that then you'll be taken to this page where you can sign up you can see here you can get a 50% discount and this is for Clickbank University so obviously these this is uh, you can watch the video here um, but this is obviously to sign up for uh, their training now obviously we put in our email address into the uh, details so if we go to check out our inbox you'll see Clickbank notifications email verification so just open up your email and click on the link inside your email just to confirm uh, and verify your email so once you've done that then you'll be taken to your Clickbank dashboard and you'll see this is the nickname that I set up so confirm 3-2 um, as I said, just at the bottom of a pay, uh, you know, an order form, then you'll see uh, that at the bottom. So confirm, you know, confirmation, that kind of thing. Um, I thought that might be 
um, useful to use that. So thank you for your email address has been successfully verified. And yeah, so now you're in your ClickBank dashboard. You can see here, this is where you're gonna be seeing um, your earnings. And you can see here some more details, but that's um, how to set up your ClickBank account. So just follow the instructions and you'll be set up in no time.